Hey guys, the objective for this video is to compare the stream function and the velocity potential function. So first looking at the velocity potential function, essentially what we want to do is we want to consider the change um, in velocity potential as we move from one point x, y to another point x plus dx, y um, plus to y. So we're considering an uh, inter infinitesimal change um, along our x, y, 2d plane. So essentially we're looking um, at the change in the velocity potential function, which is uh, d um, velocity potential, and that's equal um, to the change, partial change in terms of x times dx, plus the partial change in terms of y dy. So therefore we can simplify this down because we know this is equal to u and this is equal to v. So clearly um, the Velocity to change the change of velocity potential function is equal to u dx plus v dy, and we can therefore rearrange that, um, considering um, that the change in the velocity potential is equal to zero um, along a constant uh, velocity potential line. So from that, what we get is uh, that dy dx is equal.